right, you guys, here we are, Soul Hackers 2, and we are at Bar Hydra because I was running around trying to get Arrow's soul level up to fucking 60. I said the F word in the first 10 seconds of this video. YouTube's gonna yell at me. And while I was running around, I found a girl who was like, that man you run around with. I used to know him as a kid. I had such a crush on him at the orphanage, but he got moved to, to a different orphanage. And I was like, Arrow? And she said, yeah, him. So I was like, oh, we got a side quest where a girl has a crush on Arrow. That's definitely got to bring our soul level up with him. And also, I just want to see how that goes, because I want to see who he is as an object of desire. So here we are. Does the name Echo ring a bell? Echo, huh? Yeah, it does. I remember her. Let me turn my volume down on my... Really? I think so. Only one person I can think back to has that name. Back memories. I was still at the orphanage at that time. I have this really nice memory of Christmas Day. Back then. Excuse me. I was pretty fail and frequently got fevers as a kid, and unfortunately, one of those times felt on Christmas. While everyone was having fun at our Christmas party, I was lying down in the next room. I remember being really out of it, but it was hard not to listen in on everything. That's when she brought me some cake. She's sweet. They should date forever. Yeah, she can have him. I don't need him. I like him, but I don't want him. Hmm. Aha. She being Aiko. <laughs> yep, just the two of us sat there eating cake in the dark so the teachers wouldn't find out. Teachers at the orphanage? That's a nice memory. Right. Yeah, and it's one I won't forget. To tell the truth, I don't think I ever could. Well then, if you were able to reunite with Aiko, what would you do? Well. I couldn't. Uh... Oh, no, that's not what I mean. It's just a what-if kind of thing. No. There is no what-if, I just can't. My memory with Aiko is precious to me, but it's in the past. That's a healthy approach, I feel. Or is it not, because then he's running away from things? I don't know, leave me alone. I think it's healthy to let things be what they are and to not try to hold onto them forever and shape them with time into what you want them to be. Yell at me about it. The me of today is a lot different from how I used to be. The world I live in, the way I live, everything's changed. Even if I were to see Echo and we got to spend all this time reflecting, what then? It, to what end? It's not like I could ever go back. It only calls me pain in the end. It doesn't have to cause pain. It could be a beautiful thing. Rather than be saddled with all of that, I think it'd be best if we just never saw each other again. Mm. Aren't you thinking about this a little too hard? And if you want to see her, just do it. Literally, life is for the living, bitch. It could go either way. Take it as it comes. I don't, know. don't plan too much ahead. You're probably right. But it was because of my weakness back then that I let Kaburagi down. I won't repeat that mistake. That's why I... Oh, we hit 61, bitch. I see. I gotcha. Sorry, Ringo. <laughs> why are you saying sorry? Sorry. That's... Well, I'm just sorry. He's a thoughtful man. All right, ready to go get that gate. And hopefully that's all we need, because I fucking am not reading... Look at all these fucking side quests all around here. Oh, one of these girls was the one. She's the one that had a crush on him. Let's talk to her. Hey. <clears throat> Sorry I'm coughing and stuff. My my throat's all fucky. I got a Vizzy Hard Seltzer mixed with some cranberry juice. It is 723 on a Sunday night. Happy Sunday night. That last video that I uploaded in this playthrough, that was just earlier today. Didn't like that video. I don't know why I didn't like it. I wasn't comfortable recording it. Um, we're chilling now, though. We're going to have fun. Okay, or else I'm gonna revolt. And we're chilling for the night, because I'm hoping to get to bed by like, get in bed by nine, get to bed by 10. We have it 4.30 to start my things. I'm breaking out everywhere. Remember a few videos back, I came in with a wound on my face. The wound, mostly gone, visually. But we are, let's pull this up. Wrong one. <laughs> we breaking out everywhere else, huh? God is mean sometimes. Look at that pretty picture on the TV. This room's cozy as shit. I know you want to hang out in here, and you know what? You're welcome to, but I know y'all... Y'all ain't here. Hi, hi, um, what did he say? <clears throat> I gave her his answer. Oh, so it didn't work out. I get it. We weren't together that long, after all. I bet he's got... No, we don't. But he's got a girlfriend now. I don't want to barge into his life and make things com- Why I gotta make things complicate? What am I thinking? I'm thinking Rihanna's complicated and Avril Lavigne's complicated. And I almost threw them together right there. Uh, make things complicated. Okay, yeah, I'll be okay. At least I know he's happy. Thank you. Thank you. I think I can move on now. 
Art anklet. Ooh, what does that do? A Christmas memory. See ya. That's from the shop I work at. It's for men. Oh, a man with an anklet? I didn't realize I needed a man with an anklet until right now. I need to jot that down in my fucking... I don't have... Oh, I don't have my phone. I don't have my phone. Should I leave it that way and be free from the, the chains of the 24-7 virtually accessible? Which I'm not. I keep my phone closed and I don't pay attention to notifications. I am not accessible. Yeah, well, we don't need it. But what if I have to Google something at some point? I've got a computer. But, uh, I want to jot that down. A man with an anklet. I need to start visualizing and manifesting a man with an anklet. Gabe? Man, I love Gabe. If you put on an anklet, we could try this again. We'll not try it again. We're trying to get incur Whatever. Moving forward. Mind your own business. That's for men, if that's okay, I mean. Okay, so to the axis. Finally. If you hear Garrison in the background, leave him alone. He's downstairs FaceTiming with his younger sister. And Garrison's like, oh, do you want me to crochet you this or that? And she's like, oh, I want to this or that. And he, I'm like, you are her older brother, not her grandmother. Like, Garrison, get a job. Except for Garrison has a job. He works pretty... Actually, because I love change and I feel like I need change right now. I feel a bit uh, stagnated. And I love my job. I really do. But I'm like, I could work at Garrison's job. So I'm like, I might work there. But I don't know. I really like my job. Pays well easy requires nothing of me but i think maybe i want something that requires more of me but then i'm like well then why don't i just give more of myself to my current job and it's just i don't know there's something about the way i thrive in change and there's also something to be said of like well even when you're outside of change you should still find ways to thrive and to give and grow that's true but if i can trigger change in ways that are healthy and not detrimental and you know why not also do that? But we're here to play a game, not talk about my life. But we are also here to talk about my life because the game is kind of, I said it last time, the game's not boring, but it is repetitive for a viewer who's not getting the fun of gameplay, jamming the A button in turn-based combat. Um, do you think this one's gonna body me? A menacing demon awaits me on the gate. Are we healed up? I think we are. I'ma just, I'ma, 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 not proceed, I'ma save real quick. MP's not at 100%, but you know what? 100% is too much. We don't need to be on fucking maximum overdrive. How does the man save around here? Let me sip this busy and cranberry juice. With vitamin fucking E and zinc and all that garbo. You'd think with the amount of zinc I consume, my skin wouldn't look like this, but to be fair, I've been off my zinc lately. I don't think that's it, though. I don't know what it is, I'm like... Looking at my diet, I'm like eating the same. If anything, I'm eating better than usual. Um, I touch my face a lot. I don't be touching up here though, but that's where I glue wigs. But I'm always gluing wigs and I'm not always breaking out there. So, but some things just have to be a mystery. I can't sit here and ruminate too much on it. If it stays like a problem for a long time, then I'll approach it. But we'll just let it disappear for now. All right, let's proceed toward fucking what's this thing's name? It's not Metatron. It's like a male angel with a Cleopatra cut and like, I can't tell if I hate it or if I think it slays. But also, can both things not be true? I can hate something that slays. In theory. Is, his name's not Metatron, what is his name? Foolish. Do you think it's like a gold metal bulge underneath that flowy cloth? Not that it matters. Be on your guard. He's strong, how strong? I love when she says that. Let's hope he doesn't body me. Um, He looks like he would be weak to fire because fire, We're that's weak though. I'm gonna try ice. Sure, Sandal, Sandal Fawn. It's probably something from the Jewish, the Jewish books, huh? Okay, resists that, Almost terrible news. Wow, well, shit. This. If he's weak to electricity, that'd be great. We got a lot of electric attacks. Mm. Life isn't always as kind as you would like it to be. be well, fuck! I'll use a gun. Okay, weak to gun. That's not too bad. Have we done fire yet? No. I know it's medium, but it's to all, which is kind of a waste of MP. I'm gonna just try it out. Resist. He might resist everything but gun. He's got that holy presence about him that says, 
I might resist things. <laughs> How do we feel about the Israel power? No, not a friend. I'm not even gonna finish what I was saying because you know where it was going and we don't need to have that conversation. I don't know enough to say anything except for I do know evil when I see it and I saw evil in a lot of, I, I've seen evil in a lot of places. Um, Moving forward. Well, I mean, what's better? Something he resists or just a regular attack? Well, since there's multiple people on the field, I might as well do this. Okay, blocking it. Great, love it. I'm getting deja vu, and that's a weird. To get it while playing a fucking game. Yo, I learned that, because I don't know a lot about Persona 3. Never played any version of it, of the 9,000 versions. Excited to play Persona 3 Reload, as I've mentioned a hundred times in this playthrough. Um, they blocked that shit. Let's see how he feels about just regular attacks. Okay, doesn't resist it at least. Um, where's it going with this though? Oh, I learned. Y'all know Elizabeth in the Velvet Room. I don't have my phone, so I cannot show you photos. If we beat this battle and you remind me to do it, I'll pull it up on the screen. There's a girl in the Velvet Room named Elizabeth. She's kind of like the attendant, but she has a brother. If you play as the girl, which you can't do in Reload, you can choose the brother to be the assistant and he's fine as fuck he is so fucking fine we're not doing so hot i'm not looking to lose i'm gonna be honest with you um, all my things that hit multiple people are like <laughs> can fire A weak that he doesn't resist or a medium that he does resist? Like, what does more damage? Let me see, it shows numbers. 130, okay. But, uh, the brother whose name I don't even fucking know. Theodore, I do know his name. He's so fucking fine, and I would never get to meet him even if I was playing a version with the girl because I'm not choosing the girl just so I can fucking see hot men. I will always play as a man to my own detriment. Um, because I'm a sexist. And that's why I don't date women. I'm actually gay because I hate... I don't even hate women. I kind of love women. <laughs> Woo! But I am gay. I am gay, but I like fucking women. Well, let's talk about it. When people... I'm romantically gay as it comes. I do not want to kiss or date a girl. But I do have, like, a second... We don't have to do this a hundred times on my channel. Um... But Theodore's hot, and it sucks that he's not in the fucking new game in any way that I can run into him, so... But you know, we don't always get what you want in life, and maybe that's for the best. Maybe it's good that I learned to love Elizabeth. I should learn to love women. We're not doing so effing hard. I should heal. This is the last turn. I should have used fucking Milady's turn to fucking heal. My dumbass. Okay. Also, I haven't been buying items like I need to, to keep stock. I only have one of those. That'll be enough to get us through. I hope. God, please bless me. Dear Lord, please bless me with fucking not dying today. I know I've said it, but Principality does look nice in this game. Ringo, if you die, I swear to F and G. Okay, broke her. F okay, Ringo, you get to get a wall. You have no great attack that's gonna land, so we're just gonna use something good. I don't need to heal everybody. I got anything good for one person? Not really. Oh, here we do. We got fucking seven of these fuckers. All right. Is my camera slowly slipping. I feel like things are getting lower. Don't worry about it. Finish them off, I'm not going slow and steady, but no, he's not even at half health. We are not winning this up. We're just wasting time. I also need to kill the, the principalities. I really do. They're strong. Be on your guard. 
I want to heal because my lady's on her way fucking out. But I'm going to be bold and try this. Weak to gun. Don't know what he's weak to. I'm planning ahead for when we die, like what I need to build my team around to beat Sandalfon. I just heard something vibrate. Is my phone in the room? Or is it the iPhone? Who healed? That's fucked. That's a whole turn worth of damage. Okay, there goes Milady. Milady. He has gun damage, so he's gotta shoot. My daddy said shoot. Alright. And then hopefully I have an item that brings back what's her name with full health. Half full. <sighs> kind of a waste because I know I'm going to lose this battle, but. I'm going to just do one of these and hope for the best. I should really maybe should be aiming for those principalities, but like. I just can't. But they're the ones doing the most of the damage, it seems. Melody's on her way out again. Don't get her summon. More. That's two more fucking turns worth of fucking shit. Fuck damage. Are you kidding me, Sandalfon? You're a fucked up fucking beast of a man. I say the F word a lot. All right. Do you guys think I can win this? Do you think slow and steady will truly win the race today? Or will the rabbit cross the finish line first? What am I doing here? Let's do items. Yeah, she does, except I don't know where the X button is on this controller because I'm a fool. Is that the best I got? I don't have great items. Which is crazy because I do be like making such an effort to like check the stores. I'm gonna just use my bead for her. Well, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have done it. Maybe I should have healed everybody because we're all not doing so hot. I bet the fucking Megaton nerds hate watch me play these games. I'm not a strategic fucking smart boy. I'm just the hottest one playing these games. I'm not the best by a long shot. <laughs> and I'm not the hottest person in general, but you ever seen the people play Shin Megami Tensei games? Yeesh. No, I'm just kidding. Sorry. I'm sorry. These are my friends. You guys are my friends and my peers and you're all hotter than me. I'm so sorry. I'm also not that hot. Look at me from the side. Yeesh. You know? So... Don't know what I'm saying. If I want to stand a chance, I'll fucking heal the girls. <clears throat> it sucks that, like, my person with healing moves has gun attacks that I need. So I'm just burning through my items. At least two of the principalities are almost dead, so, like, at least those two turns will be gone. No! This is my worst nightmare. Use an ice attack. Okay, so I'm gonna use. I'm gonna have Saizo shield himself in a moment. Guard us, but I need him to shoot his gun, bro. <laughs> and they block that shit. We gotta win this, no matter what. You don't have to tell me. Do this, which does basically nothing. You know what? I'm gonna just you don't attack. Have to tell me. Feeling lucky, Melody? What's the right move? See how they fucking feel about it, you know? Okay, they're weak to electric. Good to know. Easy way to take them out and also to Oh, easy way to get Sabbath. Why was I not thinking about that? Okay, if we do die this time, we've got a plan for next time round. That'll work. You know what to do. Take out these freaks. Build up the Sabbath and let it hit Cleopatra the man. But he's got good knees, huh? What's our opener? Mm. 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 
I need to use this on her. Because she's dying. Also, if you see me leaning like this out of center of frame and sitting back here, I have to live my life comfortably, alright? Live in la vida comfy, cozy. Or else I will not have fun recording. If I'm not having fun recording, you're not having fun watching. Mm. Blast arrows fucked. There have been multiple battles where we've been absolutely. Oh, there goes Saizo. Ooh! Double whammy. No, he shouldn't push it. You should re heal the ghouls. Um. I don't know. Because then Ringo's gonna die. This might be the end. Like you need more Things might be bad now. These might doing, be the, the end times. <laughs> that little sliver of HP she's coming back with is just enough for her to get fucking bodied next round. Here we go. There goes her. There goes he. There goes she. Sizel standing strong. I hate that when they heal. That's so messed up. Yeesh, this is fucked. Okay, um. I think we know what this is about to become. I'm actually gonna, like, revert to my save. I'm gonna, like, force close the game and go back. Let's not even kill the time. Also, my Xbox, it did this previously once. After, like, I put it away for, like, a long time and didn't have it set up. I set it up and it, like, wouldn't connect to Wi-Fi. I wouldn't see any Wi-Fi. Nothing. And there's, like, I haven't rebooted it yet, but last time this happened, a reboot didn't do it. I think I even did, like, a reset, like, a full reset, didn't fix it. Um, or maybe I didn't, but there was something. There's one thing you can go in here and, like, clear out that did fix it. And I have a screenshot of it somewhere in my phone, so I'm going to find it from last time and fix it. And I'll come back next time and let you know, not that any of you, nobody watches these, much, much less people, like, with that issue. But just in case, I'm going to say it on a video in case somebody does somehow run into it. But we gotta go win this battle. And I think we can do it without like re shaping our team. I think if I just attack differently instead of just fucking going whole hog toward uh Sandalfon. See, no internet. Alright. I hope we can do this. You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to pause the recording and get us to like at least halfway through the battle. That way you don't waste your time in case this is another failure. So give me a moment here. I'm going to respect your time and have me a little bit of fun. Be right back. All right, we are back. It's been maybe like four minutes. I'm getting through this a lot quicker. He's at half health right now. I think he's about to summon more principalities. But yeah, knocking the principalities out with electricity. Letting the, uh, ooh, 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 things looking bad. What are you I don't doing? need to explain to you what's happening. You don't care enough about that, but, oh boy. Okay, we got to bring our girl back. We'll bring her back with Melody. So she doesn't contribute to the Sabbath like the other two men do. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think half HP will be okay. Oh, let's just do full. I can always buy more. You guys yeah, going by a lot quicker than y'all. Also, this Vizzy, not tasting so good. I don't know what it is. It tastes like powdered sugar, and I don't know how to explain what I mean by that. But I Y K Y K, and you don't know. If you know, you're a liar, is what you are. Super slain, but I think he's about to summon two more principalities. It's been a while. Yeah. I like them being here though, because they're easy to take out and they really add to that Sabbath. Watch fucking this. This is all you missed, is me doing this to his previous two fucking... Uh, what do you call Elizabeth here? What's her name, Elizabeth? Principality. Jesus, I'm really bad sometimes at remembering words, and I'll like just like, my brain will substitute the word I'm looking for with another word, like this one was Elizabeth, and like lately it's been doing that a lot, I don't know what to tell you. 
might take right. looks like it'll work. Let's see some fire. This might be a shock. Ooh, ouch. We're at instant chance. Remember to pace right. yourselves, everyone. Here goes. Oh, also, I, I boosted <laughs> in addition to like just attacking, uh, approaching this battle differently. I did raise all of our levels by five. I was like, why not? We're at level 45. We should be at a nice 50. A nice solid 50, I think, is healthy for us at this point in the game. See, when he does this to somebody, he usually absolutely kills them next turn, so I should probably block with that person. I just don't have the patience, though. And I also don't think he's going to survive this turn, so I think we're going to be fine either way. I do like that his little metal toes, I don't know if they're metal, is he made out of metal or is he like metallic reflective skin? Flesh? I don't know, but I like those little metal toes are out. out of my way. There we go. Keep them coming. Let's hope that this is as far as we needed to get in uh, Arrow's Soul Matrix, because it's as far as we can go. His big yellow eyes are so... He looks so much like Rex from Xenoblade. I should probably shouldn't be touching my face. Oh, Raven's here. In this memory. I hate Andrus, whatever his name is. He's a bitch. You're naked for what reason? You're not even hot. old is Arrow currently? How old are we? How old's Raven? What's the age gap between us your and Raven? Your control has gotten a lot more consistent. I can tell you built up your stamina too. You handle your demons like a pro. But most importantly, I want you to understand this. You got a good heart. That's the most crucial thing someone can have. It's the most crucial thing anybody can have, but I guess if, yeah, if you're summoning entities that can fucking feel that shit. If I had to guess... Take your strength of will from that promise, right? Yeah. I see. Well, Earl, if I were you, I'd keep an eye out for word from Yadagaras. Paperwork for official appointments can take a while, but it'll get here eventually. I love that even Street Rat Fight Club is like bogged down by like paperwork and admin. Agent Orange. Congratulations, Arrow. I know how hard you've worked to reach this point. His ass, his ass has no lips. I'd never have gotten this far if we hadn't promised each other we'd be heroes. I know, Kaburagi. You're out there too, fighting your own battles. I remember Kid Kaburagi a few videos ago? We saw Kid Kaburagi scare away some bullies and be like, You can see demons? I do whatever I want. 
<laughs> he was a gangster little kid. I saw a familiar face in there. It wasn't long after I met Kaburagi that I awakened to my potential as a summoner. That's when a Yadagarasu scout saw my powers. They had me transferred to Komodori. And at Komodori is where I met Raven. I spent my teen years there. And when I graduated, I found out about Devil Summoners. And that Raven was one of the best. I knew I wanted to be a hero. But when I saw how he fought to make the world a better place, I realized he was the kind of hero I wanted to be. If Raven dies in this game, I set my sights on training to be a devil summoner. I'm gonna be so fucking mad. Match up to Raven. A happy ending for this game. That's how you fulfill your promise to Kaburagi. Yeah. Is Ash and Sizo still together and alive, or dead together? One the or the other. Society. We had this long talk about how our lives had gone. And Raven happily taking care of that orphanage without the stress of having to groom them for crime. It wasn't all that different from my situation. After I got transferred to Komodori, he awakened his abilities too. And one of Phantom's agents picked him up. So the only reason you two ended up on opposite sides was just a twist of fate. Street if rat Papa civil Rocky war. Awakened his power first. Or if the Phantom Society had found me at the orphanage before Yadagarasu stepped in then things might have been completely different. Maybe it wouldn't have turned out like this. Well, that's a hypothetical. Ion doesn't really think in hypotheticals. <coughs> well, they didn't before. Ion doesn't exactly have a concept of time. All they see is cause and effect. And what humans perceive as linear time is just a long sequence of that. But I like now, that. I understand the difference between... My ex-husband thinks time is linear and I don't. So... I get what you're thinking. You call that irreconcilable Politics, right? differences. If I had done one thing different, how would my life have changed? Then I'm guessing you also know why there's no point agonizing over the past. Well, yeah. But even if you know worrying is pointless, you're still gonna do it. Hey, Ringo. Do you? No such thing as a wrong choice. I think you make that's choices. Up to you, Arrow. You're the only one who can decide what wrong means. And you can't know what happened yeah. in the other option, in the alternate yeah, universe where you chose right. the other option. Sorry. Maybe I so don't project what you head. wish would have happened onto that other option you didn't take as if it's inherent to having chosen that and you'd made the wrong choice. Does that make sense to you? If it doesn't, it's because I'm bad at words. I do make sense, though. Demons of Recon or additional rare items? Higher stat counts of battle. Do you build? I don't know what this means, but we're finally going to fucking pick this one. <clears throat> Yeah, and I use ice attacks with him, so actually that works well. He always acts really? so calm. Oh, fuck. It fucking is auto reading. Hey. Hey. You always act so calm, Arrow. Or maybe it's just that you never show what you're feeling. Really? Really? What? Really? I don't know if I'd go that far. Really? Sorry. You okay? Sometimes I do get the impression that you're bottling stuff up, though. <laughs> well, sure. Out of room for getting emotional in the kind of life I've led. It's okay if you want to be more honest about your feelings, though. We should go cry at the bar. Men crying hour. There's something weirdly comforting about seeing you get all fussy. I got me a little crush on him. Harold Sandalfon can be allowed for fusion. I don't want his ass. I don't think he's cute. I don't think he's fun. What's this door? What level do you want? We have to be done in here. We have to be done in here. Game, you have to be, like, happy with what I've done. What I've done face myself to cross out what I've become. That's a good song. I won't play Beast Saber. What time is it? It's only, it just turned 7 o'clock and rise up to the clock. I saw it go from 59 to 7. It is 7 o'clock. I could play me some Beat Saber now, but I'll be sweating in my hair. Wow. Oh, because I've got the Linkin Park pack. So I can fucking go, what I've done. And I'm, when I'm in that helmet, I think I look so cool. I think I'm like, like the fucking Matrix, fucking cool ninja ass. And I'm not, I'm not talking Tyler Blevins. I'm talking like... You know what I'm talking about? I don't know how to do ninja. But, uh... I don't know how to do ninja. Um, In the ass, Tyler Blevins. Poor Tyler Blevins' ass. Um, Dear Tyler Blevins. I see, when I see Tyler Blevins... If you don't know who that is, don't worry about it. I never think, ooh, I would like to fuck him. But with, with careful thought right now, I would. 
I wouldn't let him fuck me. That feels weird. I'd fuck him. Enough. This is a real person. I love objectifying an anime boy. I do, because they're not real. Um, Real people's a little bit different for me. So, Tyler Blevins, you're safe. <laughs> safe. Um, where are we going with that, though? Beat Saber. What a fun game. I have the world's oldest fucking Oculus Quest. Meta Quest. Mine's an Oculus. It's like branded Oculus. Um, Yeah, it's like the first gen Oculus Quest. And I remember I bought it for like $400 or $300. Whatever the price was. And then, literally like months later, maybe like a year later, but I think months later, the next one came out. It was cheaper and better. Which makes sense because that first one was running on like a Snapdragon fucking... 845 or something if you don't know what that is don't worry about it but like hello um but it, it runs it's actually shocking if you like optimize what you're doing for the hardware you can do a lot with like hardware i don't know what to tell you um like the fucking switch i was gonna say look at this but this is my xbox series x and i actually don't think this game is really well optimized for the xbox i think it could look a lot better but i don't know a lot i couldn't develop a game and i'm very impressed with how it looks regardless um, I won't play on the Series X. We have a Series X downstairs, as I mentioned. Garrison got it. It is his, not mine, but I want to use it. Because it's big. It's a big square. And the other day, I was talking to my friend Harry. I said, you know what? The worst thing a person can be in this life is a square. And you know what I mean? Like a square, like somebody that's like boring and follows the rules. And it's like, hey, you watch out. Um, and I was like, even Hitler had some flavor to him. And I was like, wait, I need to walk this back. I'm, I'm committing too much to a square. It's the worst thing you can be. Because a square who hurts nobody is probably better than a flavorful person who genocided the Jews and many other fucking people. So, sorry to, um, not sorry to Hitler. Not sorry one fucking bit to Hitler. Um, where's it going with this? Isn't it funny that the Jews are doing their own genocide now? That's so funny. It's like they got the idea. They're like, you know what? Remember that genocide we were a part of? It's like you go to a good wedding and you're like, I want one of these for myself. It's where is it offensive though? Where is it offensive? Don't commit genocide, I'll leave you alone. Oh right. I'm not saying I like Palestine either. Don't get me started. But genocide's not the answer, babe. And when people I can't get into it. I'm gonna say one quick thing. When people are like, um, how can you stand with Palestine? They would have you dead in a minute because you're gay or because you're this or that. Unlike you you no unlike the person that i think would say that the straw man that i'm knowingly creating but it's like not a straw man that's a real person um unlike you i don't believe people should don't have a room to exist because they differ in opinion than me just because they want me dead as a gay doesn't mean that i want them dead and non-existent crazy fucking thought to some of y'all okay moving forward you can hear a voice coming from somewhere how's it going signs Yo, long time no see. I've been hearing plenty about the messes in your wake, though. Sounds like you've been busy. Following your instincts again? I know what happens when you start saying that. I thought, who's Hazumi? Did he have a girlfriend at one point? I thought Hazumi was keeping you on a tighter leash. Great. I know, I know. You're after the Grand Executor. Executor? Executor? Of the estate? Well, don't worry, Arrow. I got your intel covered. And you can always get the friend discount, of course. Once your mind clears, the illusion is gone, and it's all so quiet. It's all so calm. Oh, we got, we're back in portal land. Some of them are red, though. I'm not, I need to heal them. Fuck up. Um, what's this? A portal? There's so many portals. These are so stressful. Is, uh, okay. I'm going to say this one more time right now, just because I started saying and I, I don't like to. Um. To start something and not finish it though i do it plenty but then i'm gonna try to pr stop saying this so often in the future is this supremely boring as a viewer for like just these same areas me traversing them fighting the same people knocking them down and not actually fighting them i'm so sorry but i am committed to playing atlas games on my youtube and i'm gonna be honest with you my whole channel is gonna be a bunch of this with a little bit of fun interspersed and this is very fun for me i just like Sometimes I think it's a, actually a bad thing. I step outside of myself. I'm like, as a viewer, is this good? And I think it's when I get critical like that that the videos stall and lag and I'm overthinking and I stop having fun and it's a bad thing. Don't eat me. Okay. 
It is nice seeing my demons out and about, though. Got a little warp point. Always good to have. Careful. That man needs to leave me alone. Okay, now he's gone. They better not need that today. I'm gonna keep exp Oh, I don't know if there's any more shit to explore. This might be the all that's left. Who's chasing me? Nobody. Oh, they're there. How did I get over here? I'm not seeing a portal. Hello? How do I get back up there? I'm stuck. Okay, I'm gonna use the little totem to warp, I guess. Look out. Why would they make something that I can get stuck on? Get ready. Level 70. I better not need to go in there, I swear to God. Okay, now let's go back, back to the beginning. Hillary Duff style. What does that song go? How back to let's go back, back to the beginning. Back to when the earth, the sun, the stars were all around. Did Hillary Duff take us back to creationism? What was creationism? Is that Adam and Eve? Did Hillary Duff take us back to the Big Bang? Young Sheldon. Look out. Oh, Incoming. hello. What's up here? Now we Purple. Relax. We got a change in color a little bit. We got a woman snake <sighs> with the breasts. Talk to them. Doesn't get much better than that. You talk. Perhaps there's such a thing as destiny. Maybe a minute, a minute, a minute. Thanks for the bead. I Goodbye. need those. This is another. Th oh, there's a portal. But see, this is another one where I can't go back. So I'm like, well, my stuff over here. But Hillary Duff has some good songs. I think about it sometimes. Ooh, you know, what I never thought about until I went to go say the word "gypsy woman" right now. Is that that song? Is called "Gypsy Woman." Um, good song. Is it a problem? What's the song about? Can't go, can't go with her. What's that song? What is Gypsy Woman? It's pop music. I wasn't listening that closely. Tried to run away with a woman. Is that song bad? It's a good song. Um. And again, things exist in their time frames, you know. Um, that was really good. With love, good. Play with fire, good. Come clean, good. I keep hearing vibrations. I don't know if it's the iPhone or... Oh, it's my phone's ringing. I'm getting like a phone call. Found it. It's my mother. I've been meaning to call her like actually and talk to her. I don't have time tonight. I'm gonna schedule a call with her. Don't look at her number. This week though, I promise I'm gonna schedule a call. Jot it down. Okay, look at that bird though. Oh, she texted me and said, want to chat? I love her so much, I feel so bad. I'm recording, I'm recording. <laughs> look at that bird. Isn't that pretty bird? It's sitting on a cactus. All right, I will schedule a call with her this week though. I love her very much. I'm sorry I ignored her call. Don't yell at me for ignoring my mom. I'm bad at phone calls. I warn you. Do not think that simply desiring something will ever be enough. Hmm. I just read that, wasn't really taking it in. That's tea. He's full of wisdom, that one. Usually people with snakes in their eyes are either doing not great or too great, and that man was doing too great. Where am I? I don't want to be here. Do I? I mean, we're gonna follow this up. Let's see what happens. Major threat. You cannot get me. Please don't fight me. I I just have accepted that I will never be able to defeat a purple monster. Enemy. Yeah, I don't give a fuck about you. Let me get this map off the screen though. Yoink. This takes me where here. All right. Incoming. And then that's a dead end. You gotta go, bud. Remember when we first started this game, and by the first start, I mean like the first 10 videos, I was really bad slicing these motherfuckers. Now this just takes me back to where I was. Back to the beginning. Wait, no, it doesn't. Oh, 
That means... Close. Where am I now? guilt of the mom thanks really riding on me which is crazy because i like never answer calls from anybody like i've ignored her calls a thousand times before it's not like this is the first time and i feel terrible i feel really bad this time do you think that's a gut feeling that like she needs this right now and i should actually do it it's seven o'clock i can stop recording at 7 30 if i fucking play my cards right here's what we're gonna do we're gonna keep recording, but I'm gonna text her back and be like, I'm recording right now, then I have to go to bed. Do you wanna call some other time this week? Tomorrow at seven. Literally, instead of saying some other time this week as like this loose, vague thing that's really easy for both of us to skirt and not commit, I'm gonna say tomorrow, what is tomorrow, Monday? I guess I'm not making plans tomorrow. Okay, well, I am making plans tomorrow with my mother. Talk tomorrow at seven. Here we go. Solid time, solid schedule, and a solid response in case she does need me right now. She can be like, can we please talk? And I'll be like, yes. Okay, I got two million yen. Look at me. That's what happens when you get two million yen. You stop talking to your mom and you become an evil man. Has a codal, you my friend. This smell has changed. It's so alluring. Don't be a freak. Okay. Also, don't comment on my nose. I already went through that one. That one led me to where I did not want to be. Look out, Look out for who? For Ketsukoto? That's my friend. To make one as great as I, scrounge for petty cat, they said. Oh, he was mad that I made somebody great like him pick up cash for me. Well, fuck. This was but a loop. Okay, enough. Well, then what do you want me to... Wait a minute. But this took me to a... Okay, here we go. Ooh, money. I do be killing these ones. You know that. I'm always hungry. I know I've got 2 million yen. I'm always hungry for money in this game. Oh, it's Kodama. Or at least Kodama's little brother. This is my best friend. I'm not killing him for money. I'm freeing him from his burden of the material so actually i'm doing my good friend otsudama a great favor i would be a master manipulator in a relationship oh this is bad why is it so hard to hit him okay my mother just responded i do have to check that why can't I hit him? Why is he so fucking evasive? Oh, she said, well, okay, but I really want to talk now. But it's okay, call me tomorrow. I'm drinking wine tonight, though. I'm always more fun with wine. I have to go to bed. But I also know that feeling of, like, you commit to, like, having a Red Bull and some, like, whiskey, and you're like, tonight's gonna be the night. And then somebody's like, what about tomorrow? And you're like, I'm not gonna be charged like this tomorrow. I'm charged up tonight. <laughs> Kills me. Okay. I'm sorry. You gonna try it out? Oh, another text. If it's her insisting again, then I'll do it. It's Sunday night and you have work tomorrow. Like a responsible adult, upside down smiley face. I know, isn't that crazy? Enough. I'm sorry, you guys don't care about me texting my mother. Medium always damage to one enemy. Could be risky. Maybe magic attacks just can't land. That might be it. Shall we? Wish we had more I'm gonna just slowly chip them away like this. I don't know. Things are just missing. I mean, Almighty's not the worst thing to happen. He's an evasive little fuck. Is this worth the money? No, it's actually not. I'm out of here. I'm sorry for even wasting time. 
Sudama, what's his name? Tudama, I'm gonna find out his name real quick so I can refer to him properly. Sudama, I'm so sorry for trying to take your money. You clearly don't want it taken. It's not a burden to you. I wish you well and leave you to your own. Thank you for your time and thank you for your patience and your forgiveness. I don't, I don't want to imply forgiveness. That's like giving myself somebody else's forgiveness, which is just like, you don't get to do that. Sorry. Okay. I fear that that'll take me over there again. So I'm going to go here. Now we can relax. Okay, this is somewhere new. When do we get where we need to go? Because I'm getting, I'm a little bit tired of this fucking soul matrix. All the reviewers, I said, why are they so tired of the soul matrix? Maybe I get it a little Enemy. bit. I just want to progress the story. They gotta pad it out. You should do it's this. fine. So we can relax. My poor mother. Oh, now I'm back here. Okay. That's which one did I come from? I came from this. No, I have not been to this one. Yes, I have. Oh, whoa. Ooh. Oh, fucking, Aka, what's her name? Her name's like Kaki or Saki or something. She's got little monkeys on her head? Wait a minute, I've never seen those. She's got little monkey candles on her head. Enough, you guys. What is her name? Callie. Callie, right? Dakini. Callie's a different... Yeah, Callie's even spookier looking. We're out of here. This takes me where? Let's go back. Back to the beginning. Where does this take me? Enemy. This is all so confusing to me. Bear with me as I sort out the circles that we traverse. I've been through that one. Now we can relax. I've not been to this one. Except for I did just recently go to that one. Enemy. No, I'm not doing that again with him. Have I been to this one? I'm gonna figure this out. Where does this go? Do y'all remember? Okay, and then I go. Careful. What do you got for me? <laughs> that bowl cut guy that just gave us an item, he was, um, First introduced in Shimagami and into the Persona games in Persona 3, funny enough. I think Persona 3 Portable specifically. Um, I saw a video about fun facts about Persona 3. None of them that spoiled it for me because, again, I will not be spoiled. But that's where I learned about Theodore. Let me pull him up for you since I told y'all I would. So I'll show you Elizabeth first in case you don't know Elizabeth. If you saw my Persona 5 playthrough, you may know Lavenza or Caroline in... Where's my mouse? And Justine, they were like the attendants in the Velvet Room. So Elizabeth plays that same role. I don't know what's open in here. Probably YouTube. Nope, nothing. Okay. Um, I have to like reach over my mic stand to get to my... My camera is definitely like drooping as time goes by. Okay. Elizabeth P3. So she's this girl. Right? Either you know her and you love her, or you never seen her before. There's her brother, though. Oh! So let's. So that's him. I mean, that's her. Let me show y'all Theodore. His ass is so fucking fine. We could pull it up on Rule Thirty Four, but I don't feel like blurring a video or blurring out my own fucking boner. 
How do you go Theodore? Theodore. Oh my fucking god. And look how fucking like fun and queer and quirky he is. Oh, I didn't fucking pull up just the image. First of all, fine as can be. If you can can I just view the image? Thank you. And then let's pull up the quirky queer one. And then we'll get back to the game. First of all. Actually, he kind of looks like annoying here. He looks like a twink. He looks like those adult men that go on cruises. And I mean a gay adult man. When like when straight adult men go on a cruise and they're they're just being like cool old dudes. When gay people go on cruises. I'm mean on this channel. But he is perfect and quirky and queer in the best way. And he's again got those beautiful golden eyes that I can't stop falling for. Oh, speaking of falling for it. Um, let me go back to the game. Hey guys. Um, but speaking of, let's go to my Xbox images real quick. How do you get to your images? Oh, my games and apps, and then like some sort of gallery. Let's see. Let's explore my Xbox together. I don't know. How do you fucking get to your things? Where do images go on this thing? Probably not games. Captures. They really hide it from your Xbox and PS5 as well. Oh, I just need my local ones. Um, PS5 and Xbox men use PS5 the most. I can't operate a PS5 to save my life, but Xbox as well. Y'all's menus. I get real confused, so please build these for big stupid man babies. That you know, that's exactly who they build these consoles for, but like dumb ones like me. Um, first of all, her asking that was wild. But she said this earlier, Silky, boys with that sad look in their eyes. I just can't help wanting to be kind to them. If that's not fucking me in my incessant need to fix people, I don't know what is. Alright. So oh fuck. Oh, so we're still figuring this shit out. So I've been through that one. That takes me the fucking over there. I've been through this one. It takes me to fucking where I just was. And then this one takes me to where? I never tried this one. I just assumed it was going to take me to that same fucking door we were at earlier. Because it fucking does. So. Is there truly no other forward other than through this level 70 door? Because I need to progress the story by exploring Arrow's Soul Matrix. And I truly cannot go any deeper. Now we can relax. This is a nightmare of a game. Okay, well, we're going to leave here and I guess go do some side quests and hope that some of them help me become closer friends with Arrow, which most of them probably won't. We're just going to fucking burn time. But it's like we're playing game and having fun. So, like, what's the difference if we're doing side quest or main quest? Just lean into it, bitch. Fine. I'm mad about it. All right. Flamma, I got a complaint. Why? Why is this like this level 70? I'm at, I'm at level 70 with Sizo, aren't I? Oh, also, I have a complaint about this game. One real complaint. When you pull up this menu to like fast travel somewhere, you can't leave it. And it's fine right now because I'm going to go somewhere. Safe house to heal up, actually. And then I'm going to go around to the stores and then we'll do some side quests and then I'll get my ass to bed. Full of guilt. No, it's so funny because I'm like not somebody who like. I feel guilt often, but not about like not texting or calling people because like I've built a life where people either respect my space or they don't have a place in my life. Like it's just how I am. I communicate this way. It is what I am like. And I'm don't say that to me sound cold and mean and distant. I give a lot, I'm very warm, but I also don't give more than I have to give or want to give ever. And I don't think anybody should want more than you naturally have to give, because if so, then they'd want somebody else. But uh, so I don't usually feel guilt about things like this. So I, let me let that go. Let's rest. I don't need a meal right now. 
And actually, we're not going to go to the stores. I can do that in my own time. That's the least fun thing. Um, Let me pull up my quests. And see which ones I think will, like, involve Arrow. New he home is garbage. Um, Girls Night Out. Got another request from the detective Masayashi. This time, Madam Ginko made it sound a little ominous. I should go to Shinsando and see what's up. Shinsando it is. Girls Night Out. They're so cute. Shinsando. Now, who is this girl we're talking to? It's somebody we've talked to previously. Maybe it's her again. Hurry it up. Saki. Why don't you take out this Jin over in this shipping district? Oh. Yeah, that's a quest I got, but we're not doing that right now because I can't imagine that boosts Arrow's level. What do they want me to do? I'm looking for a girl. That's a man. Well? Girl's night out. They said Shinsando. What? Give me a second. Shinsando and see what's up. From the detective Masayoshi. They never said it was a girl. I made that up. It says girls night out and I just assumed that everybody involved would be a girl. Oh. It's this old fuck. Hmm, I didn't think you'd show up. You've got guts, I'll give you that. I hate his ass. What? Girls night with this man? I don't think so. That's fucking date rape night, and I'm gonna kick him in the teeth. What? Don't act so surprised. I know all there is to know. Now listen here. There's been a number of dining dad. Who gives a fuck? Dashins. Actually, maybe they're like little companies, like nice mom and pop like restaurants, but like Mom and Pop can choke. I'm kidding, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm kidding. Dining Dash and it's in Karakuchi as of late. Uh, the perpetrator, a green hair. It's always somebody green haired, isn't it? Hate to say it. Garrison's got green hair right now. It's so, not all of it. Yuck. But the bottom part, a green haired woman about 20 or so dressed in flashy clothing. Naturally, that sounded familiar. So I searched the security footage. What do you think I found? So how about it? Still going to play me? Oh, I got green hair. Oh, bitch, that's like a mint green. I was thinking like a forest swampy green. You should have just said me, my minty ass. A crime's a crime, no matter how petty, although I'm not one to let you off the- When did I steal food? Off the hook. I don't actually have time for this. Then shut up and get to it. If you're sorry for what you did, then you can apologize to the store, uno, store owners in Karakuchi and pay what you owe. I'll let you off with a warning this time, so long as you pay visit to both ramen stall and convenience store. I pay for my shit. Not like I needed to tell you where to go, though. You did, because I didn't do it. But I'm going to talk to them, see what's going on. I guess I do have green hair. Look at that. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> um, where am I going? I would love to be able to leave this menu to check where I need to go. Probably in Yeah, it's Karakucho, so. It's a ramen place and something else, he said. We'll start with the ramen. Maybe it's the item shop? Let me check. Lemon items have been restocked. Herb sake. Fucking as many as I can buy. Portable first aid kit. As many as I can buy. Chakra syrup. Sounds nasty. As many as I can buy. Can't hold any more of those. Penguin doll. It's very expensive. I'm gonna buy one in case I like, magically need one, one day. Medicine they always sell, natural oil mint. I need as many of these as I can hold. Will this do it for you? Thanks a bunch. I got plenty of these things. I got too many medicines. It's not very useful in battle though. I got plenty of our fucking else? boyfriend on the side sweet potato. <sighs> this is the worst. It's infernal. Oh, Ringo, perfect timing. Actually, Believe it or not, I had another super important thing stolen. It was her, from me. I'd recently saved up a ton of money from working here to buy a birthday present. Oh, it's one of those dolls of Ninja Warrior Gundam. What was it last time? For my little brother. 
but on the way home, I heard a strange noise shuffling up behind me. Totally took me by surprise. Hmm. Shuffling may not be the word. Maybe rustling? Like a leaf. No, wait. It was more like a whoosh. Yo, speaking of leaves. New leaf. I've been wanting to play Animal Crossing New Horizons lately. Where'd that come from? And usually Animal Crossing games, I like don't fall off. Usually I'm like a daily player for a few years. And then I go to a uh, weekly, monthly-ish for the entirety until a new one comes out. So the fact that like I haven't played New Horizons, it's because I, during the peak of it for me, I like fell in a really big, dramatic, tragic love. And it got weird. And I've revisited it a couple of times since then, but oh, you know what? Actually, I revisited it when the big update came out and I was back on daily. I forgot about this. Why did I fall off again? I don't know. But I, I fell off and um, it's just been feeling, sounding nice lately, but I'm like, I could also play the games like, cause that's like a forever game, a game without an end, which I love a game like that. But I have so many games with ends that I would like to reach those ends. I'm like, maybe I could just spend time fucking finishing Fire Emblem Three Houses I've been playing for a year. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Shuffling man in the word, no way, it was more like a whoosh. I was able to chase the thief down this time too. It may not look it, but I'm actually pretty athletic. Bye. I like her hair color a lot. Before I knew it though, they disappeared down line 14 in the abandoned subway. It's off limits, so I wasn't able to go after them, I'll go. So yeah, you're supposed to be like, excuse me, an expert when it comes to this stuff, right? That's what Miss Ginko says. You. Please Ringo, you gotta swoop down there and catch the thief for me. Will do. De La Mancha. De La Mancha. I always want to say De La Mancha. Yo, Force of Five. I know I keep talking about that shit. It's a big thing in my life right now. That shit's in Mexico. Mex and it's so pretty because I love Arizona. Arizona's like my favorite place in the world other than maybe Missouri. It's, a, it's a, I think, a pretty close fucking tie. Ramen I'm looking for. Sushi? Um, ramen. Is this ramen? Are you ramen? Welcome. Ram install owner. He's got long. Oh, he's, is he fuckable? I know we went over this previously and I couldn't figure it out. Garrison likes men with long hair. So Garrison, I'm trying to find Garrison. He's got a high ass ponytail. Welcome. Hey, hold on. You're that girl that ran off without paying. No, I'm not. Time to pay up. Well, it's nice to see how much you enjoyed the food, but you still owe me. We're gonna need 550 yen or I can't. Oh wait, you know what? This is a different mission than the one I just got from De La Mancha girl, maybe. I was thinking they were the same mission. Or I can't serve you anymore. But I didn't steal anything. I mean, I don't mind, like, I'm rich as fuck. I don't mind righting the wrongs of the world with my money. Did I steal ramen? Where else am I going then? If not, let's see. Girls night out. Convenience store. Oh, that's gonna be like a. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think I already passed it. What's this? Cafe Renaissance. Yo, Beyonce had that Renaissance album, Act One. She said at the time, and we we're like, "Fuck yeah, Act One!" And then I think we all forgot promptly that it was like a multi-act thing. And then she said, "Act Two, country music." I said, "Oh." Come on in. I'm like, okay. I haven't really listened to those two songs that came out. I'm like aware of them. Um, I'll listen at some point. I told you, I don't be listening to music like I used to listen to music. I saw you swipe our merchandise. What do you mean you don't know anything about it? What, do you have a twin? Or, do I have a twin? Because my twin, the my closest thing I have to a twin has purple hair. And she would never steal. I would steal way before a fucking Fig would steal. I got that dog in me. Fig does not. Fig doesn't even have that cat in her. Fig has... Fig has a squirrel. No, squirrels would steal. What does Fig have in her? A rat would steal. What animal would not steal? I think all animals would steal from humans. Just like all humans should be able to steal from corporations. Like the things that have robbed you of your natural life that you are owed, you're allowed to steal from. We took that from animals. They can steal from us. Corporations took that from us. We can steal from them. Not to be an extremist. <laughs> I've never read fucking nary a book. So I'm not one of those like overeducated like Karl Marxist. I'm just somebody who like sees things for what they are and I'm not afraid to fucking fight. What, you have a twin or something? I highly doubt it. 
at any rate. I'm gonna need you to pay the 550 yen to cover what you stole. Okay. I don't like the people think I did this, but I'm happy to make the world right. If I could fix the world with 2 million yen, I would still have a few thousand yen fucking left in my name. That'd be so fun. Back to Masayoshi. When I hear Masayoshi, I think of Masayoshi Shido from what? Persona 5, because I what? Can't stop talking about other sh Mega 10 games. Um, he was in Shinsando. Cheers, yeah. It's crazy how, like, Ball, the company Ball, has a fucking chokehold on the fucking glass jar market, huh? How'd they do that? Is that a worldwide thing or just an American thing? Shins what's your name, Masayoshi? I hate your ass. You're back. But wait, what's going on here? I did hear from the stores in Karakucha that you paid them back, and I believe them. But just now, I got a report that the same thief appeared again in another location. Cause it's not me, mate. Says the thief ran into the central line, but that's way too far away for it. from here for it to be you. Why? Why? Two of the same. Who do you think it is? Sometimes Saizo, who does not have green hair, sometimes Saizo looks a little bit like me. I'm like, hmm, this is weird. That doesn't. Off we go. Line 14, line 14, line... Right? That's what they want me to do. <clears throat> is it line 14, right? Central line? I'll go find that shit. So be line 14. But he said central line. Let me... I think it's 14 for some reason. Let's see. Come on out. Before I start running around in here, let me make sure I'm in the right area. Girls, night out. Central line. I think it's in 14. I do. Look out! What'd you see? Why got exclamation mark? Hey, Summoner. How you doing? Yada yada. I got words for you. I'm Frost Brother number three. He, Frost Saburo. Good to meet you, ho. You got real chops, he ho. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm he hoping you'll take care of a few demons here. I'm not here to fucking. I'm so tired of gentrifying the fucking subway for this fucking shit fuck. I want to call him Chinese so bad. I want to call him Chinese. And I... If I could live anywhere in the world other than America or Australia, it'd probably be China or Japan. So I don't say Chinese as like some thing or like I'm against the Chinese. But they do have a way of um, buying buildings and leading to gentrification. Is it wrong to call a spade a spade? I think it's wrong that I said calling a spade a spade is saying the Chinese are shifty, because I don't mean that. I mean so well in this world, and I don't fucking... What's the line between being funny and having a point and being offensive and being evil? Because I'm nice. Okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just Vancouver, the Vancouver situation of it all. I'll accept the request. He called me a stupid gal. I've been away a while. See, long stint of working away from he home, but my old place kind of a tight squeeze for the whole family, ho. So hey, don't. I get to thinking. We gotta get some new digs, ho. Some rec I'm not. St actually, I will not be doing this quest. Morally, I will not be. Frost Hero's deathly allergic to Shisa. He is like a little dog, so I guess it makes sense. Well, I hope you figure that out on your own. I'm not killing dogs just because you're allergic. Or your Excuse me, your brother's allergic. Now, I'm looking to find... This man that ran... Oh, this person looks like me that ran off in here. Ooh, but this is a nightmare. This is an absolute fucking nightmare. Oh, I wasn't for sure that there's a door there. Okay, I got lucky. Lucky number... Oh, I need to tell my sister thank you for the card. She likes to send mail, and I got a card that said... 
This is just said, like, you're lucky or something. Like, you're so lucky. And, like, T, I am, like, a pretty lucky person. I was like, that's such a bizarre card. And that, that was, like, printed on it. I was like, where do you find a card that just says, you're lucky? Enemy. Incoming. How about you mind your business? You know what? I'm in his subway line, so maybe I should mind my own business. Where is this person that looks like me? Get ready. Okay, that's probably a Shisa that he wants me to kill. I will not be killing a Shisa for him. So I don't work for the gentrifying Jack Frosts. This leads nowhere, it seems. But in case there's a man at the end, I gotta check. Let's take it. There's a boobid baffle, May. Next best thing to a man is a boobid baffle, May. Yeah, die, you fucking cart. I'm not doing this. Count Jack Frost, who I love, not usually, just not these ones, that went well. will not win. This is not his subway. And if he wants it to be his subway, he's going to have to work on that himself. Actually, no, I'll defend the subway against him. Careful. I will not live and let live. I will make sure his ass does not. What do you got? What are you doing over here? A winged demon is finally swinging something around. It appears to... This looks nothing like me. This must be the present Yume was talking about. Oh, this is... Oh! Because that's a different quest. The Line 14 quest and this quest are... Duh! Okay, well, we did this one. What's to do with this stupid thing? One little smack is totally... Oh, Black. took her to... Oh, that was her brother. She just got... I'm going to have to buy a new one. I'm fixing the world's problem with problems with money. Should have stolen something that's actually worth my time. Seriously, what a waste. You're... I'm going to fight you. Who are you supposed to be? <laughs> Who, me? I'm Lilim. What's it to you? Wait, you want me to give this back? Mm. Eh, don't wanna. <laughs> the owner really needs it back? Not anymore since you broke it. Do I look like I care? I stole it, so it's mine. It's broken, you won't care about it. I can't believe You took something that meant the world to somebody, and it means nothing to you to the point where you don't even touch it and you broke it. Like, what's the fucking point of that? You're evil for what reason? You really want it? Okay, then you can have it. But if we're doing this, then you gotta give me something, too. Starts with an L. Can you give love? <laughs> oh, my life. Love and life are borderline synonymous. They're strong. Be on your guard. What are you weak to? Level 26? What do you mean she's strong? No, she's not. I'm gonna do all that now. Oh, she would have been dead too. I'm so annoyed. Okay. Let's work together. We'll do much better. Get the fuck out of here. Give me that tablet. I'm gonna fix it. Pretty good at fixing things, actually. Younger brother's present. It won't turn on anymore. It looks like Lola must have broken it. You should report back to you, mate. I don't want to. I don't want to, like, even Look. upset her by the thought of it being broken. I want to just fix it before I bring it to her. Now, we gotta go mainline, because that's what we meant to do. Me accidentally solving another quest within this quest is very funny. Um, You press the... Oh, I guess I have to find a totem thing. Which, there's none nearby, so it's gonna be a fucking trick. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't feel like talking to everybody. Not necessary. Excuse me, you fucking bitch. Now we can relax. Now we go to the main line. I fucking hate your ass. I even hate him. I don't think he's evil. He's just like selfish and not mindful of the world and just like takes, takes, takes. Central line. Do I don't know where on the central line? Central line's a big fucking area. It just says central line. You know how much exploring that's gonna be, bitch? I don't have time for that. Alright. 
And it wouldn't appear on the map, so it's really just like fucking explore every- climb every mountain. Let me just double check in case it is listed in here what part. Just central line. Dude, there's so many demons, damn. So long. Should I cross over to the left and check over there first and then come back around here? Yeah, I will. Damn, we've been recording for an hour and 21 minutes? Shit. Do you want me to pause it while I go find this person? Or do you guys want to hang out? Because I don't know if I have much. I'll find something to say. What do you guys want to talk about? Want to talk about how my nose fucking itches and shit? Yo, let's talk about fucking spring. And the way it's been sprung and unsprung so many times already this year. It is mid-February. February 18th, I believe. February 18th. Sunday, February 18th, 2024. It is 7.47 p.m. Um, nothing in here, so I don't know why I came over here. I should have known that. Um, but, where's it going? Oh, it's it. I said this in the last video. It was 70 the other, 60. Well, it was 70 a few days ago, 60 the other day, and then the next day, snowing and icy and nuts. Did I already say this? Like, people, like, the, the flowers are confused. The tulips are opening up on the warm days and it's like, oh honey, you got a big storm coming. Quite literally. So then they all die because they open up and then boom. And then there's these little red and black bugs. I've mentioned them before. They like to huddle in the warm corners of like in front of my house and sometimes in my windows if they can get in and I don't mind. Sometimes I find one like roaming around the kitchen or like in the shadow somewhere in my house and I know that they like the sunlight and the warmth. So I'll pick it up on my finger and take it to a warm part of my house. Like we are roommates, bitch, we are friends. Me and the bugs, cause I, what? I gentrified their land, they are loud in my house. And sometimes I like let bugs outside cause I'm like, I don't think you'll be able to survive in my house. There's nothing for you to eat here. Um, So I'll put them outside, but like, these guys just want warmth and like a good time. So I'm like, we'll have at it. Now, let's go to this side and see what's going on. But yeah, fucking flowers are dying. Kurt Cobain in bloom. I should just say Nirvana. I really undermine everybody else in Nirvana by only talking about Kurt. Curtis, my dear Curtis Enemy. Cobain. Yeah. Kurt Kerbunkle. So this guy earlier had a mission for us, and I did it without you, and he looks quite tired and unwell. His hair's gone quite long. I bet it's soft and greasy and not soft. And full of dust and crumbs. Free crumb. Um. Let me get back to the little warp thing. Is this fun? I don't want to be mean to a game, because I really like this game. I don't like this. That's such a big fucking area. I did the upper area. I did not do all the upper area. What is all of that? Quite annoying. But things are what? Oh, this is the forbidden area. I don't think it's gonna be in here. This area was something else. It was for that man we saw earlier. He gave me access to over here. So I'm gonna go upper area and see what happens. Is this the hallway with the puzzle with the doors that shut? Cause I'm not feeling that. I wanna see this green haired girl before I go to bed though. Like I really, you know, it could be close enough this video here. We're an hour and a half in. But like, I want to know what's going look on. Incoming. You look out. Can relax. Enemy. Get ready. Um. Oh, what's this? Door I can't use. Okay. Enemy. Enough. Quit spawning. 
Nobody in here. Nary a green haired coral. I look so weird. I light up and I have like Aurora's hair if Aurora was like radioactive. So like, what do you mean somebody looked like me? It's like when people tell me that they see somebody that looks like me, I'm like, well, first of all, that never fucking happens. Nobody ever finds anybody that looks like me, which sucks because I always find people that look like my friends. I'm like, look, this person looks like you. And they're like, wow, they do. I want to see somebody that looks like me. It's very rare. But when it does happen, I'm like, you better have a picture because if you just like say you saw somebody look like me and don't show me, I don't know what the fuck that looks like because I'm weird looking. Do I not have a weird fucking face? Um, once my cam, my friend camp, ooh, saw somebody at a bus stop that looked like me many years ago. But he did. That person did look like me. <sighs> Goodbye. Those purple ones are annoying because it's just like, Enemy. I am just going to run. You fucking losers. The crow with the fucking ruffle collar. I want him so bad. I don't know if he's really good or useful, but I want him regardless. Friends aren't about practicality, they're about finesse and flash. And that bird has finesse and flash. Am I going back where I came from? I'm fully going back where I came from. I don't know. No, I'm not. That's just a different part of the fucking thing. I'm looking for somebody. Anybody. Anybody. They're probably gonna be like in a room. I doubt that they're just fucking William Nilly on the fucking hallway. Oh, bird family. That's cute. A mommy and a daddy and two little lesbian babies, but not like together. Um, we leaving. It's a tactical move. Goodbye. Y'all are so mad that I'm progressive. Call me fucking Flo because my ass is progressive. <laughs> All right. Have you seen a fucking person that looks like me? Tanta, you don't ever know nothing. You're useless. You and your bowl cut. Enemy. I don't have fucking time for all these fucking enemies. Where the fuck would this person be? What do you mean there's somebody in the line? No, there's not. <laughs> Quite simply, no, there's not. You all fucking lied. I mean, there's a room over there I could get to. Careful. They're gonna be in that room. And if they're not, then I'm gonna have a fucking breakdown. One time I worked a bank job, but not like that. It was like a teller. I did like security systems for the bank. And I was not there long. I had like a genuine, like, what would you call it? Like a nervous breakdown one day. Not because of the job. Just because of like, I was really unwell and on a lot of drugs and just mentally unwell and like not eating right and not sleeping right. My body wasn't right. And I was like, had every fear, anxiety, stressor living in my brain uh, and drugs and just everything. And I lived with somebody. It was just a mess. Oh, what is that? Wait, this is just a side quest. This seems quite serious. We had a, a fucking, sorry, who was it? Was it Wells Fargo? What's the one that's evil signing up people for their own accounts? It has a picture of like a horse and a carriage on the front of it. It was that thing. Sorry, y'all. Not sorry. Fuck y'all. Um, <laughs> but you were really nice to me. Like the individuals I met, they were nice, but fuck the company. The demon that looks like Ringo. She must be the one causing trouble in Kerikucho. Yikes. Oh, so you found me. That's right. I'm Ringo. I'm you. They call me. I want a doppelganger so bad and I want to fuck their fucking brains out and I'm gonna <laughs> slop them to death not to actual death though that'd be fucked I don't want to see me dead well it could be interesting they also call me doppelganger hey. what do you think this is where I live up until recently I'd been alone but the truth is I saw you fighting the other day you look like you were having a lot of fun and I guess I got jealous <laughs> so I borrowed your look and went outside for oh it's ditto for the first time taking your appearance gave me courage oh I'm, I'm glad it could the outside world is so beautiful, and the food is amazing. I was, she's just living her life. She's just a girl living her life. I'm happy. She found freedom. She found her freedom in the music. Find Jesus. Find your Kubrick. And I paid for it, so it's all okay. You go live your life, and I will I will pay for it. You just be nice to people, okay? Don't make people think I'm mean, because I'm nice. Don't say nothing about the Chinese. Don't say nothing about Israel. You go out there and don't reflect badly on me, okay? Hmm. <sighs> 
but all anyone did was make faces at me. I was just trying to be happy, and all I got was a bunch of scary looks. I gotta ask, is it because I don't put Oh. She's a creep, she's a weirdo, but she's not. This is my new best friend. You have to learn the rules. Rules? What does that mean? So... Money. So I needed to give them this money thing. I'll give you a million if you need it. Money is those round things you find on the ground sometimes, right? They wanted that. I see. That's why they were mad. If you, instead of taking my form, which you're welcome to have, well, to take. We're both going to have it. Um, if you take the shape of a rat, you can take things and nobody's going to get mad at Both will get mad at you. But nobody's going to, like, look at you sideways if you don't pay for shit as a rat. Rats kind of have it easy in this world. I know everybody hates them, but, like, when everybody hates you, you have nothing to lose. And that's freedom. Rats are free. Except for when they get tangled up in each other's tails. You know a rat king? That's not freedom. That's rat 911. Sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't know I would get you in trouble. I don't have any money, but here you can have this. She's my friend. Home see of life, good ya. to have. Thank you, kind summoner. She even said my name. She says, see ya. Can I make her say my name again? See ya. That's me, bitch. That should prevent any further incidents. Report back to Masayoshi. That was fucking cool. We're going to report back to Masayoshi and close out this video. It is now almost 8 o'clock. It is 7.57. It, it feels like it was not that long ago that I watched the clock strike 7. Now I'm watching it strike 8. It's my own Cinderella moment. Okay, Um, how do I get out of here? You do the triesto. It's more steps than it needs to be. Um, And then you go to... Shinsando. You would talk to this man. Let me also get this down before I close out the video. Am I going to take a bath tonight? I kind of want to. I should. It's what I deserve. A hot bath in like the dark, like dimly lit, like dark red lights. And I'm really lather myself up, like really fucking soap it up and get clean as shit. And be dry as fuck <laughs> and be clean and flaky. Is that so? You. Did you catch the culprit? I see. I thought more about it, but the only explanation is that there is someone who looked exactly like you. You're so smart, Masayoshi. Wow, no wonder you wear a suit, because you're so big and smart and strong. It's a stupid occult theory, to be honest, but I don't want to believe it's true, but it probably is. I'm sorry. Making false accusations the way I did, it's shameful for a de oh, you're a detective? How have I not picked up on that? I'd like, I love a detective. Wait a minute, we could be friends. Yo, I, I bought a game on Switch, physical, um, called, what did I just do with my hair? Um, what is it called? I'm gonna pull it up. The reviews were not great. People did not seem to like it, but they didn't seem to hate it. They seemed to be like, well, I appreciate the thought. <laughs> but I looked at it because I know I know my tasting games. I've never like bought a game, played it, and be like, I don't like this really. Um, I know when I am and I'm not gonna like a game. Oh, I fucking called Mato Anomalies. And a lot of reviews were like, it's kind of going for Persona Shin Megami Tensei, but it's also its own thing, and also you're a detective, and also it's not good. And I was like, I'm listening to everything you said but the last part. Let me pull this up bigger. So I got that, and I'm excited to play that, except for I don't know when I'm going to actually get to it, because I have, if you haven't seen, stacks of games. But maybe because it's Atlas Like, I'll play it on the channel. And then we'll just drop off the minute we decide it's not good, but I think I'll like it, because I know my own taste. Taste, I've said this before on this channel, you don't have taste until you like something that everybody else hates, and you hate something that everybody else likes. You have to, like, love a piece of shit and hate a piece of like a masterpiece before you have taste. Thank you. But I know my own taste. There it is. That's it. I don't know. It's 20 bucks. I was like, what? I love a, I love a good fucking physical game. Oh, right. Bigger good. I'd like you to have this. I said, he's actually not that bad. Let me start giving him that grimy little voice as a token of apology. Mirror pendant. I'm always getting these accessories and never equipping them. Next time, I won't remember to, but jot it down. Remind me to fucking check my accessories, update my accessories. I really am sorry. 
And with that, and with a pretty fucking good day, good day of soul hacking down, which nary a soul have we hacked in a very long time, but you know what I mean. I'm gonna go. Have a good night, have a good Monday, have a good Sunday. This is not coming out till fucking... I think this is coming out like in over two weeks. So fucking, cause it's February 18th, when is this coming out? Regardless, have a good one.